What's up, you guys? This is Robert at Shy Bears Plus, sponsored by Colt Fan Tears. <sighs> They're still good. They're still good. Anyway, Robert at Shy Bears Plus on Twitter. Go ahead and follow me there. You found me on YouTube. Hit the subscribe, the like, tackle the bell. Make sure you don't miss anything. What we're talking about is the Bears' week three preseason game. Which was pretty much the Andrew Luck retired game. Uh, as far as the game goes, Ryan Null, I think the dude earned a spot on the squad. Find a way to figure it out to fit this guy on, right? I mean, he's just a, a guy who could do anything. He could catch the ball in the backfield. He could break tackles. He leans forward when he gets tackled. Just a good player. I mean, I, I think he's worth uh, you know trying to be your fourth guy. Vauders also showed up. But who even cares about this game? What people are going to remember is that Andrew Luck retired in the middle of a game. Some people are so mad. They're so mad about it. Nationwide, players are mad. That Fans are mad. I see everybody's side. I don't care. I'm just going to laugh that Andrew Luck retired just before the season and it didn't happen to us as the Bears because we have, you know, kicker conspiracy extravaganzas. We have quarterback carousels for 20 years but this has never happened to us which makes me very 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 happy made some memes you know having having some fun with it uh, as soon as I as soon as he quit or it leaked that he quit during the game someone leaked that information I guess he's going to try to retire the next day at three o'clock on Sunday who quits in the middle of a game I mean I don't know. I know a lot of people quit their job during, during their job, so I, I get it. And I feel like those people can't even be bad. Like, if you didn't put your own two weeks in, dog, like, you can't even say anything. What are you really going to say? I don't know. Um, it's it just it's just so funny to me. But I see, I see it, man. The guy has been, been healthy for four years, playing through injuries. Football is a tough sport. Getting your butt kicked for 16 weeks plus four preseason and plus playoffs – Man, it cannot be easy trying to play through the little injuries. They aren't even really injuries. They're just the, uh, you're just hurt. You're hurting. Are you hurt? Are you injured? Going out there against the best in the world. I mean, I played football at a very low level and got my butt kicked plenty enough to not really care if I didn't play anymore at some points, being very discouraged. So I could see Andrew Luck. I, dude, I, I see what you're saying. Plus, a dude's like 29. We've been lucky and blessed in the last 10 years that quarterbacks have been playing as long as they have. Like the Tom Brady stuff, like, that was never happening before, playing until you're 40, maybe mid-30s, but, you know, guys retiring at all at other positions before 30 is pretty normal. The guy gave it a shot, he gave it a go. I'm not mad at him. I mean, plus, he went to Stanford. I think he majored in architecture. He's a smart dude. He's got other options. He's funny. Uh, I'm sure the networks want him to work for him. There's a ton of stuff he could do besides getting his brains kicked in. If you don't want to play football, if your heart's not in it, I could see it being an extremely hard sport to play when you're getting your brains kicked in. It's just the way it is, man. It, it's not easy. So I, I totally, I get it. Andrew, I get it. I get you, dog. I get it. Colts fans, the way things went down, I understand why you were upset that it leaked during the game. I understand why the the booze might have came out. Emotions probably ran a little wild. Got the best of you. I'm sure next time you see Andrew Luck, he comes to the stadium. He's going to get a standing ovation. There's going to be all the nostalgic, great memories of what a great player he was. I'm sure this is going to pass very soon. And I feel like there's been major overreactions on all sides. I get it. I I been hearing and floating the uh, the old conspiracy theory that uh, his dad was Ali Luck is has something to do really high in the XFL and he's just going to retire here then move in to launch the league next February with the XFL. Heard it here first, folks, or not? Whatever you heard it first might have been here. But hey, here is Shy Bears Plus. Don't forget to hit that bell and like. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I see all sides of it. Just my take. I'm not super upset. 
I had a friend say, what if Trubisky you know, quit week three for the Bears? I'd be super upset. But if he had a good reason, it is what it is. I always say, I want players to play as long as they can. As long as someone's willing to pay, pay them and they want to play, play forever. I'm never a guy who's like, oh, he's washed up. He should quit. If you want to play, go ahead and play. Brady, if someone's going to pay you to pay till you're 50, play till you're 50. I don't care. And if you want to hang them up early, you do you. Do whatever you want. It's a tough sport. Plus, these guys, you know, they're making money. They're making good money to where they can walk away from. So, and I understand it. If you don't want to be getting your brains kicked in, then just leave. What was it, Borland or something like that? Middle linebacker retired from, like, the 49ers or something after, you know, just a year. A year, eight years, 13 years. Do whatever you want. I don't care. I'm happy to have you while you're here. If it was my quarterback, I'd be a little upset. I would probably get over it, but I would be mad. However, if Trubisky had a bunch of injuries, I'd be the same with him with luck. I don't care. It's no big deal. I just, um, you know... I'm gonna drink these Colt fan tears. I just thought it was funny because something bad happened to another team, so I immediately found humor in it and man thought about how mad they were going to be and how bad it's going to suck. So I, I've just been having fun with it for the last couple of days. It's been fantastic. Good luck to luck. Whatever you want to do out there with your crazy life, with all your dough and your new girl married, go travel the world, do whatever you want, come back, play. I don't care. Everyone, Bears have a pretty good chance of going to the Super Bowl.